I'm on the road to scratch golf. Come along for the ride. Oh my gosh. Hey, what's up? We're out at Suffolk Golf Course today, playing a quick 18 in between the rain showers. It's 70 degrees today. It's gonna be snowing four inches tomorrow. So getting the work in today. This is a 300 yard par four dog leg right. I'm trying to sneak it around the corner. No good. So I hit the five almost on the line I wanted to hit it on. It was like a foot too far to the right, which is unfortunate because that meant it hit the top of the tree. I needed to go just past the tree and then it would have ended up about 100 yards out. Instead, now we got a 180 yard shot around the corner. It's gonna be difficult. So now I've got to hit a dog leg right, almost 90 degrees, club face is wide open. I'm swinging left with the club face open and there it goes, hoping to get it to run up on the green, but this is a little short. Not terrible though, we're about 30 yards out. I've been practicing these kinds of shots. This is what I've been working on my short game for. Let's see if we can get this one close. That's what I'm talking about. Up and down. All right, par three, about 100 yards. So for 96 yards, that's not good, even though it's on the green. It's still way left of the hole. That one I should be putting, I think, within 10 feet of the hole. Misread the putt. Misread the break. Misread the speed. So, I have a little tough comebacker here. Oh my gosh. Well, that's a bad bogey. I was in the hole, but didn't account for the left break and hit it too hard. Damn. Part five, I'm hitting a cut shot, trying to hit 200 yards, 210 yards, have it end up at the bottom of the hill. So I've sent it up almost exactly where I wanted it, except still on the down slope. I had hoped it would run down to the bottom there, but that's okay. This is a 140 yard shot, should be able to get up there with eight or nine. That's a nine iron. Trying to get a draw. Downhill, side hill lie, 141 yards. Hit it right over the flag stick. It's just a two putt from off the skirt, off the apron, around the green. And these greens are usually very fast, so on there, get a good roll. That was a great roll. Not a bad putt. Should be an easy putt. Yes, another par. All right, the par 3, 16th, 168 yards. Decent tee shot on the green. All right, I'm gonna get to practice my sand skills on this one because we ended up Rolling off the green into the bunker. So, gotta get this out and up and down. Now it's been raining, so the sand traps are all like caked mud. And you can see it here in this shot. Nah, no break. So my only bogeys have been on par threes, which is embarrassing because I should be trying for birdies on those. All right, I jacked this up. I hit the time lapse. So there's a slice, right? Hit out to the middle, 100 yard shot onto the green and par. All right, this shot, tee shot down the right side, hit the draw to the middle of the fairway. Beautiful shot, We're about 240 yards out. Don't want to go over the water too much. So I'm trying to just hit a layup out toward the trees, but not that far. Of course, I get it all. Carries. All right, so that was just a horrible second shot. Trying to lay up for an approach shot. Trying to hit it over the water. Wanted to hit it in between shot. And of course, hit the eight iron long, hit the cart path. And now it is right here next to the tree. So, 
Are we dead? Not yet. Because the green is right there. And we got a hundred yards. So see if we can do it. Hundred yard under the tree from the pine straw. That's a half a nine iron. Ah. Almost. Got on the green, wouldn't hold, went into the sand. Damn. Wasn't bad. Not bad at all. Thought it was gonna roll a little more out, but didn't. At least we have a par putt here. I'm looking at this. I know this goes down to the water. Should be pretty fast. I know it's gonna break to the left. Well, break to the screen left to break to my right. As it always does. Downhill, I should be able to just get it a good wrap and it should go. So close. All right. Thanks for watching. Had a great nine holes. I uh, ended up three over and I just missed that par putt by a millimeter on that last hole. But again, that's what we're working on, getting up and down. So if you want to figure out how to improve your golf game and learn how to get up and down, keep watching, like, and subscribe. We've got plenty more videos coming up. Bye.